Ammonites, you have uh, Moabites, everywhere Jakes were. But told him, he told him like, you do the same. Because you gotta understand the Roman, the Greeks at that time, they had a role of rulership, power over these other nations. If, if they tell them to do something, they had to do it or they, could, or they was gonna get beat up. Just like nowadays, they tell in the Saudi Arabians, they're like, hey, you better start giving females driver's license to let them drive around, you know? Start doing that. So all these things, they're pushing upon these heathen nations, man. You know what I'm saying? That's <laughs> crazy, right? Huh? Tell you how to handle their right. own women in their own country. Right, they tell you how to handle your own women in your own land, man. Tell, they're telling you how to rule, rule in your own land. You can't do certain things according to what you want to do, man. Because one time they saw, they wanted, they silenced the, the, the president of uh, Ghana, his Twitter, and then he blocked Twitter in the whole country, man. And then they went to beg, like, don't do that. He said, you block me, I'll block you. <laughs> Funny as hell. <laughs> Showing his power. Yeah, man. <laughs> Ain't no Twitter no more in Ghana. I don't know if they fixed it, but they went to go suck penis that day, man. No, please, please. Don't do that. You know why? Because they can't push their propaganda hey, no more. Say That's why. Bobokusha, in, 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 uh, in Russia, uh, uh, Russian influencers are, are, are saying that they, uh, they, uh, they destroyed their lives because now Instagram is banned in Russia, man. You know? They can't make that money. No they, can't, they can't make that money. They don't have that influence. They don't have that, those likes anymore. That's good. McDonald's is gone. Cat Turkey is gone. That's good. You know? They're going to put your bitch ass back in the cave, stones, uh, Stone Age, where you belong. And that just goes into prophecy because right? you see that all of the nations are, are furious with, with that great horror. Where, with that, uh, the fornication of that wine that they push into every the nation. Kool-Aid. Yeah, come. Don't drink the, the Kool-Aid. The Babylon juice. Come. Don't drink the Kool-Aid. Don't drink the Babylon juice. Come. Don't uh, drink the Kool-Aid. It's, it's, it's anonymous with don't drink that Babylon juice, man. That Babylon cup. Come. That's First, their philosophies. Don't believe in it, man. It's going to destroy you. That strange woman. Proverbs chapter 4, no, sorry, 5, chapter 6, and chapter 7 speaks about the word of wisdom, which is thy wife, thy sister, thy uh, mother, and don't listen to strange women, man. It might sound sweet, and it does sound sweet, especially if you're in the world, you know, because I know a lot of Jakes, not a lot, but I know a few Jakes that they heard the Islam thing and they joined Islam, man. Do it in jail. Because it, 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 sound, it sounded beautiful for them. Not only that, uh, it, it, it looks stricter. It looks strict. Like, look, look what the church, these discipline. church people yeah. are doing. No, no discipline. Some do you order. think that these people are... You can do whatever you want, man. There's no rules. Be a sodomite. You know? So people think they gravitate to Islam because everyone is in sync, in, in league, in structured, you know? Doing the same thing, you know? The military type shit. Yeah, IOSC man. should start with pushing that Islam thing, man. Before you know it, these uh, Sakari guys, they're going to take away the New Testament altogether. And they're going to revert back to the Old Testament. Because I think I heard that they said that worshiping Yahweh Shai is idol worship. I was going to make a video about that. You know who worships, uh, who worships Yahweh Shai? Get Hebrews chapter 1 on there. Just hold it there. Right? Can you read on? And verse, this is Second uh, Maccabees chapter 6 and verse 9. And whosoever, uh, whoso would not conform themselves to the manners of the Gentiles by force should be put to death that's yeah. it man they would force you yeah. in order for you to actually follow their customs and this happened generation after generation and before you know it that's how we became Israelite Edens and didn't know which what, what which what, which way was up that's why you have a lot of our people worshiping flying reindeers worshiping bunnies that lay eggs meanwhile they know that it is a lie but they continually do it and with the hope that they might get saved by a fat dude coming down the chimney even though you don't have a chimney coming down the chimney and your kids putting up socks you're telling your kids a lie putting up socks and stuff like that and then you go put things in their socks and stuff like that man that shows you that you're a demon and then later on there you tell them don't lie to me don't you ever lie to me my whole life don't you ever lie to me boy you know what but you're lying to your kids by telling them that the flying reindeer is going to come and give them presents with a fat dude. You know what I'm saying? You need to put milk and cookies for them. You're a liar. So when your children lie to you, don't get upset. You should just be uh, very happy because you passed that lie, lying spirit on, that lying tongue. Okay, uh, was that it? Go to another.
there for what happened with the women. Right, right. Whoa, go on. Uh, and it says, they, Then might a man have seen the present misery. Verse 10. For there were two women brought who had circumcised their children, whom when they had openly led around the city, the babes hanging at their breasts, they cast them down headlong from the wall. So they threw them off the... Of yeah, the, the tower, of the, uh, the, the, the city walls, man. Go ahead, go ahead. Can you get first Maccabees 3 and 48? This all started with the Adiosius Epiphanes, man. Kind of. Those evils being multiplied back into the earth. Right. Kind of. uh, first Maccabees 3 and 48. Kind of. <coughs> because uh, uh, Alexander the, the creep, he had uh, Israelites in his armies. And they could just practice their uh, religion. Right, yeah, kind but, of, yeah. uh, at the Oceans, it, it really started getting bad. They got it start, started getting persecuted. This is uh, First Maccabees chapter this 3. It shows you how messed up we were. You have to understand, you are under another nation, and he says, I allow you to serve your God. Go. That's fucking disrespectful, man. Think about it. He just tell you, like, oh, you can, you can do it. Meaning, meaning, you get his permission and his say. Because if he says don't do it, you can't you can fight back. It shows you that we was already under, under like, it's fucked up. Another motherfucker has to tell you whether you can worship your God or not. That's, that's a, that should be, that's a slap in the face. You can't tell him to not worship his, uh, his uh, uh, Roman gods. Go tell him then. You be, in a, you be in a cow that very same day. He would take a cow, some hot cow, and then he would put your dumb ass in there and burn you alive, man. That's how that, that's how he would punish you if you would boldly tell him, I don't want you to worship your gods today. This happened. Yo, yeah, this it, happened. it did happen. With the with the, uh, the seven the seven sons and the mother, she came and laughed. She laughed the king to scorn. She was laughing at him because he said, the last son, she she called he called the mother to tell him like to convince him like come on tell him to just listen and and hearken unto my word and I let him go. And the mother laughed at him and he spoke in Hebrew. She was laughing at him. She said, Bro, you better take your death like your brothers. And so he killed them, man. He killed them. So you see, we were under them even then. We've right. always been under them. And it shows yeah, you second uh, Maccabees uh, 7, I think. It shows you a whole different mindset, man. They rather die. Sense. They rather yeah. die than to serve their enemies. Man. He right. was a young man. He yeah. was young. Man. Yeah. 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 This is uh, First Maccabees chapter 3 and verse 48. And laid open the book of the law, wherein the heathen had sought to paint the likeness of their images. Right, right. The heathen did that, man. Can you give me Hebrew 1 and uh, 1? What's up? Can you give me Hebrew 1 and 1? Okay. Hebrews 1 and 1. Yahweh who had sudry, <laughs> Yahweh who had sudry, ti sudry times and in diverse manners spake in time past unto the fathers by the prophets had in these days um, like, had in these last days spoken unto us by his son whom he had appointed thereof all things, by whom he also made the worlds, who, be, who being to the brightness of the glory and the expressed image of, the, of his person, and upholding all things by the word of his power, when he had by himself purged our sins, sat down on the right hand of the majesty on high being made so much better than the angels he's made much better than the angels as he had by inheritance ob obtained a more excellent name which than is they which is Yahweh Shai because let's say Michael means uh, one, like the most high one like one who is his God yeah, Raphael I forgot the meaning Raphael Got the meaning. You had the uh, Gabar, Gabriel, which is uh, the warrior of the Lord. Gabar the Allah, warrior of the Lord. I forgot what it means, but then uh, you can look it up. You can look it up if you have the time. Yeah, he is the he is the angel of healing. Yeah, he is, but yeah, that's not what his name means. If I'm correct, I don't know anymore. I looked it up back in the days, but I forgot. But then, uh, can you go on until verse six? For unto which of the angel said, He at any time, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee, and again I will be to him a father, 
and he shall be to me a son. And again, when he, when he bring it in the first begotten into the world, he said, and let all the angels of Yahweh worship him. See, that's the point. The point is that you say that you don't, you, you, you are not allowed to worship Yahweh Shai. The angels worship him. What are you talking about, man? That's why you did away with the book of Hebrew. You know, well, you didn't do away with it. You're, tell, you're teaching your congregation to do away with it. Because you can't do away with the word of the Lord. You can tell people that you did away with it. And you can act upon it. But you haven't done it literally. You know what I'm saying? The angels worship Yahweh Shai, man. So read that again. Hebrews 1 and 6. And again. Hebrews 1 and 6. And again. When he bring it in the first begotten into the world, he said, and let all the angels of Yahweh worship him. Let all the angels of Yahweh worship him, man. The angels worship Yahweh Shai. So now go to uh, Revelation. No, 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 wait, before you go. Revelation. To, no, 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 wait, before you go there. Go here, Matthew 15 and 20, 20 and um, 5. Matthew chapter 15, verse John 25. 15:25. Matthew chapter 15, verse 25, and it reads, Then came she and worshipped him, Matthew 28, 9. saying, Lord, help me. So read it again, but you start off. This is Matthew chapter 15, verse 24. But he answered and said, I am not sent. But on to the oh, lost. You know what? Give me, give me, let's read the, 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 you know, don't you know what it's talking about? Verse 21. Uh, Matthew 15. He's walking then, uh, the coast. Yeah, 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 start there. Yeah. Okay. This is Ma Matthew chapter 15, yeah. verse 21. Right. Then Yahweh went thence and departed into the coast of Tyre and Sidon. And behold, a woman of Canaan came out of the same coast and cried unto him. Saying, Have mercy on me, O Lord, thou son of David. My daughter is grievously vexed with a devil. But he answered her not a word. And he and his disciples came and besought him, saying, Send her away. For she cried after us. But he answered and said, I am not sent unto the lost sheep of the house. But he answered and said, I am not sent. But unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Right, so now he's going to help her. That shows you he did not go against his own word. Because he said, uh, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. And then he turned around and helped her. Then he would go against, and who sent her? Then he would go against the one that he, was, he, he sent. That's why we know that that woman from Canaan is an Israelite. She was living there, and the Israelites, and the, the Jews that were in the know, that was living amongst the Jerusalem and, stuff, and, the, and the Israelites, it was like, get this dog out of here, man. Let, let, let her go in the midst of these filthy heathens where she lives. She lives there, right? She don't want to live amongst us. Get this beast out of here. But Yahweh Shai said this. Go on. Verse 25. Then came she and worshipped him. Wait, go on. Saying, Lord, help me. Wait, go on. But he answered and said, it is not meat to take the children's bread and to cast it to dogs. He didn't stop her. He didn't say, like, don't worship me. That's the point. He went into, he just he kept on talking to her. Can you read the other one that I said? This is, uh, this is Matthew chapter 28 and verse 9. The gangs are scared of death. They, they put the mask on. Yeah, he got tattoos all over his face and he got a mask on his face. And as they went to tell his disciples, you were real gangster. Behold, Yahweh <laughs> met them, saying, All hail. And they came and hailed him by right. their feet right. and worshipped him. And worshipped him. Go on. Let me see if he said, Don't worship him. And then Yahweh and then said Yahweh unto them, This is what he said. Be not afraid. Did he say, Don't worship me? Go tell my brethren that they go to Galilee. And there shall they see me. Okay, now read the one that you have. Okay. He this didn't say don't worship me, right? Okay. Mm. This is John 9 and 38. Right. Let me start at 37. And Yahweh Shai said unto him, Thou hast both seen him, and it is he that talked with thee. 
And he said, Lord, I believe, and he worshipped him. Right? Now let me see what Yahweh Shai said after he was worshipped by that man. And Yahweh Shai said, for judgment I am come into this world. He didn't say, don't worship me. He didn't say that. Yeah. I have a reason why I'm bringing up all these scriptures where he was worshipped by men. And he didn't repent them like, hey, rebuke them like, hey, and, uh, repent uh, from uh, worshipping me. He didn't do that. So that's the point. So now go to the Revelation. This is Revelation 22 and 8. And also the Colossians. And I, John, saw these things and heard them. And when I had heard and seen, I fell down to worship before the feet of the angel which showed me these things. So John, he, he, he probably was oblivious that he shouldn't be worshiping angels because it was actually in the, in the, in the, in the Old Testament, don't worship angels. So what did the angel do? Then said he unto, he unto me. The first thing that he said was, See thou do it not. What? Do what not? Uh, worship. Right? Uh, go. For I am thy fellow servant, right. and of thy brethren the prophets, right. and of them which keep the sayings of this book. So he said, I am your fellow servant. That's why it says here in the book of Hebrews chapter 1 verse 6 that he worshiped Jehovah also. Meaning, I am your fellow worshiper. You can't worship me. Here it is, I worship Yahweh Shai also. You worship him right beside me on a lower level, yes, because they have the Most High had made the angel a little greater than man. You know? That's in the book of Psalms, chapter. Where was it again? No, no, no. <laughs> I just, I just, it just, I was thinking of something and then I didn't hear it. I heard something, but I'm Yo. like, huh? <laughs> this guy is somewhere else. <laughs> I know you somewhere else, man. That was funny as hell. I said, I said, I said, I said, I said Psalms. <laughs> huh? What, Matthew? <laughs> yeah, you funny, dog. You know, that every was... time we study, like you would say, grab the scripture. Grab me 25, and huh? I was like, what? 12 and uh, 13? Bebelin Bebe Bebe Buzu? <laughs> Let's get the Bebe Bebe Buzu. <clears throat> then said he unto me, See oh, thou. Yeah, I got it. Psalms 8. Right, wait, let me read it quick. Psalms chapter 8, verse. Um, Psalms chapter 8, verse. 5. Uh, I saw that for it. What is man that thou art mindful of him, and the son of man that thou visited him? For thou hast made him a little lower than the angels, and hast crowned him with glory. And honor. So yeah, that's the point. But go back to where you were. Go back to where you were. Go back to where you were. Who was reading? Who was reading? Revelation. Get, get the revelation again. This is Revelation 22 and 8. Right. And I, John, saw these things and heard them. And when I had heard and seen, I fell down to worship before the feet of the angel, which showed me these things. Then said he unto me... <laughs> See thou do it not. See thou do it not. Do what not? Go For I am thy fellow servant, and of thy brethren the prophets, and of them which keep the sayings of this book, worship the Most High. That's the point. The scripture also says that the testimony of Yahweh Shai is uh, what, what was it again? the spirit of prophecy. The spirit of prophecy. It says here, worship Yahweh Bashem Yahshua. Okay, he said, worship Yahweh. The point is, because it's, uh, the point is this, don't worship him. That's the point. Because when somebody wanted to worship the angel, the first thing that came out of his mouth is like, don't do that. I'm just your, I'm your fellow worshiper also. Meaning I'm right beside you, a little higher than you. Right beside you, basically, oh, maybe in front. Let's put it in front and you in the back. And, and I worship Yahweh Bashem Yahshai also. And guess what? He worshipped the angel. He worshipped... The angel worshipped Yahweh Shai. The Most High said that he needs to worship him. He said, I made them to worship my son. Because he has a greater name than them. And he has a greater status and rank than them. So that's what's up. And now to the Colossians. This is Colossians chapter 2 and verse 18. Let no man beguile you. Don't, of your don't, reward. Get, don't, don't get tricked out of your reward. In a voluntary humility, 
and worshiping of angels. So you, it shows you again you're not supposed to worship angels, man. <coughs> Intruding right? to those things which he hath not seen. But it doesn't show you in any of the scriptures that you, sh you can't, you shouldn't worship Yahweh Shai. Because he himself never blocked no man from worshiping him, nor uh, any woman from worshiping him. And they all worshiped him. And he never told them, like, don't do that. So what are you talking about, talking about we can't worship Yahweh Shai, man? We're supposed to worship Yahweh Shai. Because that's that new doctrine that's going down around and floating around upon the internet from, from uh, group to group. Eventually, evil men shall wax worse and worse in the end time, man. Okay. And it's going to be a funny thing once the Most High really, you know, stamps down upon you, man. You know, back in the days you had a stomp that you would uh, seal a letter with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then uh, you stamp would uh, yeah, stamp. Uh, we're going we're gonna to get stomped, man. That's gonna be the stamp. Yeah, that's gonna be the stamp. The blueprint. It's gonna be a logo splattered on your on your neck, man. Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. Instead of on the forehead, Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. Because if you read the book of Revelation, chapter 14, verse 1, it says his name and his father's name in the Greek. We know that it says that because we saw it and I showed you. Revelation 14 and 1, it says, can you read that right now? Can you read it right now? 14 and 1. So Revelation okay, chapter 14 9 and uh, 16 and verse 1 and I looked and lo a lamb stood on the mount Zion and with him an hundred and forty and four thousand having his father's name written in their foreheads mm -hmm. but it says in the Greek having his father's name and his son's name written in their foreheads but Esau took that out out of the English on purpose because they don't want you to get it because if you check out all the other translations it does say his father's name and his son's name in their forehead Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai so guess what we are to worship Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai man not just Yahweh and you can't just go to Yahweh because can you not even here on planet earth you can just talk to the judge they're going to court they're going to court martial they're going to they're going they're going, they're going to march your ass out of the court Court martial. No, they're gonna march you out of the court in handcuffs. Sit down, Ru uh, 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 order in the court. Let there be order. You stand up talking about you want to talk to the judge. Me, you ain't got no representative with you. You ain't got no lawyer. Then again, you can turn yourself into a lawyer, but hey, only only do that when you know their laws, with their trickeries and sneaky stuffs like that, man. The loopholes. You know what I'm saying? Only if you know it, then you should actually participate. Or else you might lose. Show suits and show you. you know what I'm saying? Right, right. Show you. They got, they got the law, but they got a, they got all of these loopholes, and they just right. study these books trying to find loopholes. Right, right, right. <laughs> They're like, oh, they got him, got him. <laughs> you was talking about it, right? Remember that the Asian uh, serial killer, his, his, butt, his buddy killed himself. He looked like a, like, a, like a bear. He was hairy as a beast. And they was kidnapping females and couples, I think, uh, whatever like that. They was killing them, taking their money and all that type torturing of stuff. Torturing them. Torturing them. Crazy, man. Crazy, man. It, man. Filming it. You know? Doing horrible things. And when they found out, they, he killed himself with the pill. He swallowed the cyanide pill, killed himself. So he, he already had that plan since a long time ago. Like, if they kill me, I'm going to swallow this pill and just die. I ain't going to jail for, for all the shit that I've been doing to these people. Fuck this shit, I ain't, I'm dying. And he died. And the Asian guy, he prolonged that uh, court case for like 10 years. He fired all his uh, lawyers. He kept on doing it. Now, new lawyers need to come in and re reassess the case. It's going to take a hell of long because now they got to relearn, man. And, and he fired knows, that one. And he fired that one. <laughs> and then another one got to come and they, he, and they got to learn the case again. So this shows you like he's playing with these people, man. If it was in the kingdom of Israel, he'd be put to death right the second that he did that shit, man. We got you, you're dead. You know? We got you, you're dead. You ain't going to court. What the fuck you going to court for? We you need read witnesses. Leviticus. You read right. Leviticus, and you know? He that put the, you know, he that... Uh, yeah, murder it. Yeah, man. Should be put to death, and that's it. We just read, just read the punishment, read the scripture, and execute that punishment. Yeah, man. In front of everyone. Right. Ain't no witnesses talking about, did you see him there? Well, it could be that it was his cat. The you know, I, I saw another one, which is real funny. What you want to say? I was about to say, I saw an article about uh, righteous killings in uh, Saudi Arabia or, or somewhere. Uh, Sodomites. And so they they read the 
the the thing the, yeah. the, the thing that he did wrong, right. kill him, right. then they read it again, and then yeah. they like, look at each other, literally, they read it again, and like, right. don't, you know, like, this is what happens when you do this, and it was immediate, man, right. it wasn't right. no, yeah. and it's a jink, and it's a jinker, <laughs> yeah, God, God, it's a jinker, yeah. <laughs> it's a jink, me chopping them himself, man, yeah. it's Saudi Arabia, man, yeah. his whole family is a, is a bunch of uh, executioners, executioners, man, yeah, God. Yeah, man. That's he has a, like four or five sons. Yeah. He, had a, a, he has a big ass sword, sword on the wall. I was going to say, he got a sharp <laughs> ass sword, man. Yeah, that's a job I would not want to take. God, man. You might kill somebody innocently, and even that probably can't, man. Probably couldn't sleep right. God, that so shit. He probably likes it. Yeah. Must he be. He got a sword up on the wall. He enjoys it. Must be. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> and another one. So you wake up looking it. at it like, ooh, who you I got it? today? Yeah, God. You saw the yeah. jig, right? Yeah, I saw yeah, this. Yeah. Hey, he probably talks to his son like, hey, you got to hit him right here in the neck. That's the, that's the, that's right, sweet spot. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Practicing so, uh, on his Somebody on, got uh, something hams. for me? Practicing something on hams. hams. I mean, somebody on got something for me? What you got? Uh, uh, Psalms 9. Yeah. Psalms 9, 16. Yeah. This is Psalms 9 and 16. The Lord is known by the judgment right. which he executed. The wicked is snared in the work of his own hands. The wicked is snared in the work of his own hand, man. That nuclear missile is, 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 is one of the works of their own hand. And they're going to get snared by that, man. Because they're gonna get a nuclear missile, man. Which is the work of their own hand, which is gonna kill them, man. Because that nuclear missile is gonna kill everybody. Especially once they let it loose. And all the, all these heathens, they shall burn that whore, man. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna shoot missile upon each other and they're gonna burn it, man. You know what I'm saying? So go on. Okay. Um, Salah. The wicked shall be turned into hell. And all the nations that forget the Most High. Psalms 47, 22. For the needy shall not always be forgotten. We are the needy, and, and now it looks like we're forgotten, man. So it seems like this, but we're not forgotten, man. But the Lord did say that uh, since y'all forget me, I will forget thy children. You know what I'm saying? That thou be as no priest to me. Yeah. Give, give me Hosea 4 and 6. Here is where he says that he forgot the children, man. The expectation of the poor shall not perish forever. Arise, O, o Yehovah, let not man prevail, let the heathen be judged in thy sight. Right, right. Put them in fear, O Lord, that the nations may know themselves to be but men. Salah. Let the nations know themselves to be but men. Because now these nations think they're gods and stuff like that. Yeah. Which is uh, Psalms, uh, no, Psalms 74. Yeah, and 22. No. Is it 4 and 6? Okay, man. 72. Se I said 72, man. I don't know. If, and uh, 20, and uh, what, what time? <coughs> 22. 47, 22? Yeah. This no, no, no. 74 and 22. Yeah, I got 74 now. Right. This is Psalms 74, verse 22. Arise, O Yahweh. Leave thine own cause. Remember how the foolish man reproacheth, reproacheth thee daily. Forget not the voice of thine, like forget not the voice of thine enemies. The tumult of those that rise up against the increases co uh, continually. Read it again. This is Psalm 74, verse 22. Arise, O Yahweh. Plead thine own cause. Remember how the foolish man reproaches thee daily. Yeah, the foolish man is, is starting with Esau, man. But you have these foolish jakes that be tempting the Lord because you dash and tempt the Lord, right? But you have these jakes that be tempting the Lord, man. Commit blasphemy, saying all these crazy type things. For example, that little guy called himself Boosie, man. The bo bo booty hole. Talking about you're going to talk you know, after Moses High and stuff like that. The foolish man reproaches thee, man. That's why we tell them, we're asking the Most High to destroy that man. <laughs> booty hole, booty hole, badass. Forget not the voice of thine enemies. 
The tumult of those that rise up against thee increases <laughs> continually. The tumult of those that rise up against Yahweh Bajam, they're increasing, man. It's getting more and more. They're walking around here with sodomite uh, bags and stuff like that, not hiding it, man. And these females are Arabs, man. Yeah, it look like Israel. They're Arabs, With man. Botox. Botox. Arab, Arabs, yeah. Arab females. Yeah. Arab females. Or, or, or Aversions and shit. Something yeah. like that. Something like in that uh, region. Yeah. That region, motherfucker. But anyway, you got Arab type motherfuckers walking around with the uh, sodomite uh, b uh, bags, man. With the rainbow yeah, yeah. covered all up, up on it, man. With the six colors. You know what I'm saying? With the six rainbow colors instead of seven, yeah. which is the real rainbow. You know? They're walking around, and you'd be like, yo, why don't you go do that shit in your own country? See what happened to you. Walk yeah. around with that shit, man. Just walk around with that shit. You would be beaten up. Yeah. yeah. Certain yeah. places in Married Africa. Off. Certain certain places, in, they, they, they kill you. Yeah, man. Certain places in Africa, they do uh, correctional rape, man. Jungle justice, they call it, right? Correction rape to females only, not the men. They get married off too, man. Correction rape, but they can't do that. That shows you that the scriptures is bold, is, uh, is telling you that their their boldness is showing. They show they show their countenance as uh, Sodom and they hide it not. They're not scared. But that's a beautiful thing because once that judgment come, I want you to hold that same type of energy. That pride you was carrying. Right? Yeah, that pride you was carrying, and that that pride was carrying you. You was floating. As if you was, ooh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Right. Exactly. It was floating around upon can the planet Earth, man. Ain't nobody touch me. Come, come. She knows that certain neighborhood, she can't do that shit. Yeah. You know they know. You know that they know, man. If it's that righteous, why don't you take a flight and start going to hit deeper into East Europe? <coughs> See what happens to you. <laughs> and the motherfuckers over there will beat the shit Shut out of you, boy. Yeah. <laughs> Even them Edomites over there. But then again, yeah, you don't know what they do behind the scenes, man. They filthy too, man. You know? But anyway, go on. That was it. Uh, <coughs> give, me, give me still a few and then we're done. Hosea. Uh, Hosea 4 and 6, yeah. Hosea 4 and 6. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, right. I will also reject thee. So that's why the most I rejected us, man. And we are rejected. But the needy and the poor will no longer be rejected anymore. Starting with the elect. The rest of the Israelites, they're going to be rejected, man, the two thirds. They're going to be rejected harsher. You know what I'm saying? Because you got to understand, there was a point in time all Israel has sinned, have sinned. There was a point in time when the Most High wouldn't listen to none of us, not even the righteous. All of our prayers was a, was a curse unto ourselves. We, we prayed to the Most High, lightning mighty hand. <laughs> Remember that shit that you did in your past life? Fucker. Hey, fucker. <laughs> you require this, you Hey, read on, man, the seven. That thou shalt be no priest to me, seeing that, seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power, I will also forget thy children. And that is what happened. Is it done? No, seven. You want seven? No. Huh? Can you read 17? Come on, this is Revelation chapter 17, verse, nine, uh, verse 12. Yep. And the ten horns which thou sawest are ten kings, which have received no kingdom as yet, but received power as kings one hour with the beast. Right. These have one mind and shall give their power and strength unto the beast. These shall make war. I wanted to laugh at that couple over there, but then the Spirit told me, don't laugh, it is not funny. Because that's, that's why I shouldn't be laughing. That's why I looked at her, she looked away quick. Shouldn't be laughing at them. Hey, when, when you see, sometimes when I see a, a Edomite male with a, with a Jake female or a mixed up Jake, because I think her father or her mother is a goddamn Edomite too. But anyway, so the point is that sometimes when I look at them, I want to laugh. But something, man, is telling me, like, don't laugh. And then I stop laughing, man. You shouldn't be laughing at that, man, because you be looking at that shit. You be like, hey, man, hey, Osai, you know, he knows what he's doing, you know. That's also what we did, too. We, were, we went to war. All these other uh, gods. Yeah, and the Most High killed us, and now he's going to kill them. Mm. That's what's up. <laughs> so you motherfuckers talking about, well, you should figure, shut the fuck up. The Most High killed us, didn't he? So what's going to happen to them, then? They have all this time to repent. Once that time comes, you're dead. So you might be saying, yeah, yeah but uh, this, is how the, this is how we offended the Most High. That's good. 
what happened to us. <laughs> you hear that laugh? That's what happened to us, man. We got killed. And the most I was laughing, because he said, I will laugh at your calamity when your judge when your I will laugh when your calamity comes, man. So guess what? We ain't laughing right now. Now they have the time to actually repent and come back to your house, Basham I don't want I don't want you there. You tainted, you defiled by that either might come in your snout. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you need to stay there. And I pray Satan be on your right hand too. So you can never turn back. You're gonna have that pride. No, I ain't turning back to him. Satan ain't gonna be talking to you like, no, man, fuck them dudes, man. Fuck them. Do what you want. Do what you want, man. You free. Strong. You're free. free. Yeah, you're strong. You're free. You're independent. You got that. You got that white house and a picket fence. Uh, 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 fence. You don't need no man telling you what to do. You don't need no niggas. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Until war comes. Yeah, right. Especially no niggas telling you what to do. You might listen to white boys. Same. Yeah. You saw that female too. She was like, I need no 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 man. No man can tell me what to do. And then you saw her switch up with the yeah. either mic. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Her voice Straight changed, up. tone Straight changed. Up. That's beautiful. I pray Satan is on your right hand, man. <laughs> Let's, ain't no coming out of that. Ain't no coming out of that one, man. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Hey, that just shows you these you ain't coming. are powerful. You ain't coming out of that one, man. Put Satan on your right hand, man. Make you, make you feel good about yourself. You're real proud. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. I'm black and I'm they're proud. So, they're so... <laughs> They're so fucking proud. They put a movie on, man, where you just, that movie from, uh, uh, no, what's it, what's Boys in the Hood? And then they replay that scene, I hate your gums. Yeah, yeah. I hate your black lips. lips. You know what I'm saying? My lips. He said, I even hate my lips. Yeah, that's, uh, don't be a man of society yeah, yeah. while drinking your juice in the hood. Yeah. yeah. That one, no, not that one. That's funny. That's funny. I want that other one, that, that one that what it was based on. Yeah, it was serious. I hate your That motherfucker. I bet your ass you gonna you replay. You tough. Right. Put you that big ass gun out. Big right. ass revolver, man. <laughs> right, yeah, Cuba, Cuba was crying. <laughs> <laughs> he had that 38 <laughs> Magnum special. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> then he went home, started punching the air. <laughs> <laughs> In the living room, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He was angry. Yeah. He's like, how could this nigga do this to me? Yeah, man. We're supposed to be white people. But those, those guys in, in, in menace to society, if you pull a gun on them, they just tell you to shoot, man. Yeah, man. Nowadays they'd be the same, man. They even crazier even now. Them, man. Man. They'd be like, man, what you what, you ain't gonna shoot? Let me take that gun for you, man. Shoot you, bomb. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you. How Let me show you how it's done. Shoot myself, bam. That's how you do it, man. Now, be a gangster, finish the job. You know Why did you shoot? I wanna die. Uh, yeah, man. You got people like that, man. Yeah, man. Hey, you really got you people got like Jakes that. You got Jakes like that, man. They wanna die. You be looking at them like, man, you destroyed. Most of the time, people like that. Don't get killed. Why? Because even people be like, oh man, this man, this man crazy, man. I just leave him, leave him alone. He's crazy. Yeah. Most of the time, people like that don't get killed. It's the ones that don't want to die get killed. <laughs> they run. <laughs> <laughs> that one. Yeah, that one. Shoot what you is. in your spine, fool. Little Ooh. challenge. And you walking around like a, you're not walking. By hey, the way. Uh, did y'all see that uh, article, uh, video? Finish? Can you finish the thing? Of uh, these uh, people. Jack in these gas stations oh, in, in America. Yeah. Hey, they're slick about it. They park, and then they got these hoses that go down into the um, thing. Yeah. And they put the hose down, and they siphon all the gas out. <laughs> Thousands of dollars worth of gas. And you they don't even know. They, they're getting so slick, you can't even tell. The van drive up, take all the gas. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. That's good, because they're going to be a war for gas soon. But remember a couple of years ago, bitches were selling that ass for gas? Mm selling that ass for gas. Females was selling that ass for a sandwich in Greece. That shit's gonna come back, because now, speaking of gas, a thousand dollars to fill up a truck with gas, a thousand dollars in America. That man is gonna actually charge the people for that gas. How? They're gonna raise the food prices, because they gotta ride it in, right? Sometimes they on the, they're on the road for hour, eight hours, 12 hours, 16, 20 hours. It comes from different states. And they ain't flying, so there's more trucks than planes. You know, you got 50 planes, but you got 500, 500 trucks, man, on the road. I know, but I'm giving an example. 50 planes compared to 500 trucks. You know what I'm saying? Your shipment is coming in, but you're gonna pay a lot of money. You know, they're gonna up in the prices and start making the, the poor pay. Because nowadays they're talking about that they want to pass out new laws concerning this plastic that's going around upon the planet Earth. 
they want to actually judge the people and get the money out of them instead of actually judging the companies that make the plastic. Those masks. Right. That shows you where the where, where this world is at, man. Sure. They want to get the people. They don't want to get them companies that make that plastic. Why don't you put, why don't you put sanctions on them? They be putting sanctions on the people. You know what I'm saying? Let's finish this. Yeah, let's finish this, man. This let's is a Re Revelation um, 17. Revelation 17 and... Uh, There's a whole other chapter and then we're done. 14, yeah. These shall make... Uh, Khan, verse 13 again. These have one mind and shall give their power and strength unto the beast. Right. These shall make war with the Lamb and the Lamb shall overcome them for he is Lord of Lords and King of Kings. Yeah, you're going to fight against your Shai and your Shai going to whoop that ass. Okay. <laughs> and they that are with him are called and chosen and faithful. Those are the elect. And he said unto me, the waters which thou sawest, where the, where the whore sitteth, are peoples and multitudes and nations and tongues. Mm -hmm. And the ten horns which thou sawest upon the beast, these shall hate the whore and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. How are they going to do that? They're not really literally going to do some cannibalism type of stuff. They're going to eat her up. They're going to burn her up with nuclear fire. But nowadays, Jake's to say some shit, man, I'm going to eat your motherfucking ass up, man. He don't mean he going to eat you literally on a cannibal tip. He mean he going to beat you so hard that you ain't got no chance to fight back, man. That's that's what it means. Like, I'm going to eat you up, man. Shaq, Come on, Khabib, Khabib you said that. Shaq said barbecue chicken. Yeah. Yeah. Khabib right. said that to this. He always said that. Shaq said that. Right, man. Sorry, they gonna eat you up, man. You know. Khabib said this to a, a, another fighter. I could eat you in a street fight. Right. Yeah, he did say he did. <laughs> Wasn't it Conor McGregor? No, not Conor. Another well, guy. Yes, one of them. Hey, I don't hey, even want to fight Nate, somebody Nate like that. Nate Diaz is funny, man. Say something like that to me. I'm going home. Nate Diaz is funny. <laughs> Nate Diaz is funny, man. He's tall, okay. but he's Mexican. The thing is, I thought he was a Puerto Rican. I thought. He was a but the funny thing about Nate Diaz is, this guy can he incarcerate a lot of fucking punishment, man. His face look fucked up often, and he, ke he keeps on coming. I'm like, yeah. hey, this motherfucker, you a crazy person, man. <laughs> you crazy. You'll slap him, too. Yeah, he it. likes to slap the shit out of people. Even when he's all bloody and shit, he'll slap you in the face. His face look fucked like, up, man. <laughs> flipping people off. His face often look fucked up, but I like him. Yeah. And he's one of them nutcases that he's keep on going. Well, yeah, of course he's a jerk. Yeah. I think it's from Issachar. Yeah, he's Issachar. This is verse, uh, um, chapter 17, verse 17. For the most I had put in their hearts to fulfill his will and to agree and give their kingdom unto the beast until the verse of the most High shall be fulfilled fulfilled his will that's why they're gonna burn each other up with that nuclear fire we yeah. waiting on that day that day is getting closer and closer oh by the way give me ezekiel 30 years. and the woman which thou sawest is that great city which reigneth over the kings of the earth that shows you that the woman can be synonymous as a city that also shows you in the book of Jude, uh, uh, jeremiah chapter 3 it shows you that Judah is a, is a, is a woman, and uh, her treacherous is a sister, and Israel is also a woman, you know? So symbolically, we are that woman, and that's why that great that's why we are a harlot. Give me that in First Corinthians 6 and 14. That one and this one, and then we're done. Ezekiel 38 and 1, and First Corinthians 6 and 14. This is First Corinthians chapter six, verse fourteen. Until sixteen. God, the Most High, and the Most High hath both raised up the Lord, and will also raise us up by His own power. Verse fifteen. Know ye not that your bodies are the members of Hamashiach? Shall I? Then take the members of Mashiach and make them for the members of an harlot? The Most High forbid. Right. Verse 16. What? Know ye not that he which is joined to an harlot is one body? What, do we, what are you reading now? Uh, 1 Corinthians 6 and uh, 17. Oh, yeah, that's it, 6. I was looking at 16. I was like, what the hell? Okay. Yeah, go on. It's good. It's good. Come on. Uh, it's lucky. Yeah. What, know ye not, he which is joined to an harlot is one body? For two, saith he, shall be one flesh. Right. So it says here in the book of, uh, hey, what's up? So it says here in this book, that, because uh, I can't find it right now. It says here. It says here in, 
Oh yeah, Isaiah chapter 1 verse 21. How has the faithful city become a harlot? It was full of judgment, righteousness lodged in it, but now murderers. How can a city become a harlot? It's talking about the people. And we went against Yahweh Basham Yahashah because we were married unto him, and then we turned into a bunch of hosts, basically, right? by going unto other gods. That's how we became that faith. That's how that faithful city became a harlot. You know, this shows you again that there's a people before it's a place. You know? Because how can a city be a whore? A prostitute? A slut? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's talking about the people. And we are that woman because Jeremiah chapter 3 told, shows, you, shows you that. And also Jeremiah chapter 6. But then, can you finish the uh, Ezekiel? And what did you have? Oh, no, that's not Ezekiel. Ezekiel 38 and 1. And the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Gog, the land of Magog. So that's in the region of Russia right about now. So we also against you busters over there, man. Exactly, man. We're going we're we're to we're we're put that judgment upon you through Yahweh Bashem Yahshai with these words. And then the Heavenly Father is going to put that judgment on you in a physical form. Because the Lord said, put your face against them too, man. Meaning, hey, man, it's like in a, with a dog. I saw this... Uh, this, uh, whatever, host, this television show host, female, she thinks everything is all cute and dandy and stuff like that. She went to go pet the dog. Oh, how cute. <laughs> <laughs> the face mauled him, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because what it is, is you can never, you should never go in a pit bull face like this. That's a fight. Go do it. Don't do it, don't do it. But then, uh, yeah, man, if you do it, man, you get fucked up, man. If, if you train them to not be like that, you could kind of do it. But if a stranger comes and goes in his face like, there's a fight, man. He'd be looking, what the fuck is wrong? <laughs> hey, let's bitch. Hey, who is this bitch? <laughs> Until this day, she has a cut here on her fucking lip, man. He kissed you, man. That's the kiss of death. The kiss, the kiss of teeth, man. That dog bit her so fast, she was, <laughs> she was horrified. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What oh, was it? I don't so understand. So it's jumps for Oh! He saw that demon on his back. He saw the demon on his oh. back. That's why. Hey, I didn't even think about that one, man. Hey, the, the, that dog saw that demon, man. He's like, get your lion ass out of here, nigga. Hey, hey, hey. You lying? You don't like you? Yo, he never tried to pull The dog bit us in the face. Oh, shit. <laughs> and, then, and then the other brother said, you deserve that shit. And then, <laughs> then they started, then they, then they, then they, then they almost a fight. That was a brother I called. He said, you got what you deserve. What, would, what did you do with that dog? Did that dog, did that shit? Huh? Yeah, what did yeah, you yeah, do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, it's always gonna a, buy you a He's gonna bite you for that. But he was but drunk when he was saying Yeah, yeah, that. I know. But that's funny, man. That shows you that a dog saw the spirit like a liar. <laughs> 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 That dog showed it. He sure showed you. <laughs> he sure showed you that day. He showed you that day. crying the whole night. Yeah, man. He sure showed you that day. And she. But yeah, hey. I wasn't even thinking about that, dude, man. I was thinking about that female, that either my female that got bit in the mouth. She had a horrible cut. Until this day, she has that cut, man. And it's never going away. There's another one. She got, she got bit. Ripped the whole lips off. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I think I saw oh, that yeah, one, yeah, too. I, I think that. I saw she, that one, too. She looked like uh, Jim Carrey. Right? Yeah, yeah, oh. That's a firefighter. Uh, a fire marshal bill. Yeah. <laughs> she looked like fire marshal bill. <laughs> Let me show you something. She'll give me that picture by a mushroom, man. Can you read on it? Fucked up, man. The chief prince of Meshach, um, Meshach and Tubal uh, and Pros... Uh, And prophecy against him and say, Thus oh, yeah. said the Lord. I remember this shit. I remember this shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't show it, can't show it, man. Thus said the Lord, uh, God, behold, I am against thee. Oh so, no, so God. The, so the Mosai is also against you, man. You Russians, man. You Edomite Russians. Is your Edomite too? Believe it or not. Y'all be fighting in, inward, but Satan's house is crumbling because they're yeah. fighting against each other anyway, so that's good. They're a different tribe. You know what I'm saying? You're just a different tribe of Edomites, man. <laughs> I, I have to go into the history, but I believe 
one of the forefathers of uh, the Russians, almost, uh, 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 how do you say that, uh, um, how do you say that, uh, put, put the whole, whole end onto the tribes of uh, the American forefathers, man. Like almost, back in the days, <laughs> made them yeah. extinct, like almost yeah, that's yeah. what I wanted to say. Yeah, made uh, almost extinct. made them extinct. But I have to go into the history. Ogak, Ogak, the priest, um, Ogak, the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal, and I will turn thee back, and put hooks into thy jaws, and I will bring thee forth, and all thine army. Horses and horsemen, horsemen, mm -hmm. all of them clo clothed with all sorts of armor, mm -hmm. even a great company. You're gonna put the hooks back in their mouth, man. That means fighting. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna make them angry, man. Go on. <coughs> with bucklers and shields, all of them handling swords. Right. Persia, Ethiopia. Persia is Iran. Iran used to be called Persia a couple of uh, years ago. A couple of maybe a couple of decades ago because uh, I remember that they changed that name into Iran and then later I heard Iran and Iraq were fighting I was like why are the two almost similar name people fighting I don't get it because I remember those days and I always found it weird that Iraq and Iran were fighting I'm like huh they almost got they got the same name why are they fighting and the Iranians they they, they tell them they said they're Persian they say we got Persian food and all, all of it. so they, they know that they, they know that they're Persians yeah, right? They never left that region. No. Go on. The fact that they changed their name is stupidity also, but anyway, go on. And Libya, with them, all of them, with shields and helmets. Yeah. Yeah. With shields and helmets, go on. Gomer and all his bands. Turks. Gomer, yeah. The house of uh, Togermat. Of of the North Carters uh, yeah. and all his bands and many people with the and many people with the so the play, the region of Russia is going to have many people with them. Go on. Be thou prepared and prepare for thyself. Be thou prepared and prepare for thyself. Thou and all thine company. Thou that and are, all thine company that are assembled, assembled, assembled yeah. unto thee. Unto thee. And be thou. A guard unto them. And be a guard unto them. That's the point. Because now Russia is going down to, an, uh, how you call that place over there? It's going down to Iran and being a guard unto them, man. Which is scriptural, man. We know that this is the prophecy being set up. And in a few years, once that uh, nuclear war comes, because it's going to happen, man. It's going to happen. But first, they need to push that mandatory type chip. A lot of people are going to be, the first famine needs to come. Before the chip, famine is going to come. Famine, and then when that famine come, they're gonna be like, "Yo, you got a way out of this, man. We came here for salvation. Why don't you put that chip, and then we, we don't have to hassle with money no more. Just, 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 you know, that that would be logic." The they did in Jamaica with the new currency, yeah, yeah, yeah. the Jamdex. Yeah, yeah. they saying yeah, that you can. It's uh, crypto. It's, it's a, uh, it's, it's a digital crypto. currency, yeah. and they they saying that you won't even they, you won't need no transaction fees now. No. no. So. It's just like taxes. giving money straight straight up, no no transaction right, fees. You're like right. when you do something at the bank, you gotta pay fees on it. No, right, they're like right. we can you can do transaction fees. They're gonna take that away because they don't need your money anymore, your yeah. taxes. They need you, they want you now. Yeah, huh. And even say uh the first fund one hundred thousand, they can get two thousand five hundred dollars free. Straight up. So the first so they're making it a race already. Then she says, Let's get this money. And, th and that's how yeah. she starts she ends the video. Uh, so how much how much they gonna get for free? Two thousand five hundred. It ain't shit. I know. Come you on. sell your soul for two thousand five hundred. <laughs> Jamaican dollars, right? Yeah, Jamaican dollars. That's not. You, you, that you pay. Shit. You pay five hundred dollars Jamaican dollars for a haircut, man. No serious, man. I know. <laughs> I'm serious. You just one transaction, your money gone. <laughs> Damn, man. You buy a sack of rice, you're gone. Yeah, man. Yeah, more it's than pointless. It's just pointless. pointless. Yeah. That, 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 so they even selling your ass cheap. Yeah. That's that's just you should be dis, you should be uh, offended. That's a disrespect, man. So with that, we're going to give all praises to the Most High. Yahweh, Ba'asham, Yahushai, Ba'asham, Makar Kadash, Double honors unto the elder apostles and great millstone for the teachings of the scriptures, among other things. Shalom to the sincere Akim across the world. Shalom. Shalom.